an MMA fighter against a boxer in a boxing match for the first time. And uh, then he should box me in that ring. Be a man and do what we train to do and what we said we were going to do. So it's all going to boil down to who is the real man and who's going to do what we said we was going to do. We can get in there, he can kick and all that. I ain't going to be kicking or nothing. I'm going to do boxing. And that's what we've been trained to do and that's what we're going to do. So the wimp will real, really come out that night. If he wants to box, we box. If he wants to get in there and kick and get down and raffle and all that shit, we'll do that shit too. But I've been training for eight weeks to fucking fight, to box. And that's what I plan on doing. Thank you. Boxing's been an underground sport since way back. I wouldn't mind it if it stayed like that. And on the other hand, the octagon can't see. Human cockfighting somehow made it mainstream. Sometimes it's cool and fun to watch. But if you say that it's better than boxing, then you gotta stop. I cannot watch and say that's hard. If I wanna see street fighting, I can tune into my backyard. Don't mean to crap on the UFC, but if I wanted wrestling, there's WWE. If I wanted real kicks, there's Muay Thai. I ain't about to watch no rope in between two guys looking like they be humping on the floor, boring. At least when boxing's boring, they're still toe to toe scoring. MMA makes more money, retorted. Mayweather alone wiped them out in that department. Classic match besides the one with the blonde China man and that lumberjack with that big old mustache throwing the fist. But compared to Hagler Hearns, that ain't shit. Remember Kimbo made everybody scared, but got knocked out by a flabby dude with pink hair. Remember Tin Silver ran his mouth, but old man Ray Mercer knocked him the fuck out just to show you that an old boxer can chop down a young MMA tree trunk, a showstopper. Notice that MMA fighters got no chin, one fist, down he goes so quick. And what the fuck is all this tap out? I don't want no choking, I want somebody to beat the crap out. I want to see some skill during the process. Boxing versus MMA, no contest. I don't, don't want to watch two grown men with panties on. Wrestling, I mean, I'm from the hood. I, we, don't, we don't play that. So to compare that to boxing is ludicrous. I think of Corrales versus Castillo going to war. I think of Arturo Gatti taking it to Mickey Ward. I think of the blistering speed of Muhammad Ali. I think of the combinations of Manny Pacquiao indeed. I think of the crippling power of Iron Mike. I think of all the legendary fights that I like. When one guy gets dropped, gets up and gets dropped again. Gets up and knock the other man. Now Hollywood shit, I get goosebumps just thinking of it. Pugilism, you gotta love it. It hits you like a hook to the stomach. No knees, no high kicks, no moves that'll lock heads All I want is a bomb that'll land and make them drop dead Man to man, hand to hand, put your fist through Mexican race, believing kicking was a bitch move And that is what germs had to say At the end, boxing knocked out the MMA Boxing versus MMA No contest Martial art is for beer, beer drinkers. Boxing is for everybody. This is a, this, I mean, you can't take you can't take my shoes off and take my shirt off and just throw me in a cage. You do that with animals. You don't. You can't do that with with you know. With, you don't do that with humans. I don't know no fighter in MMA that has generated a total revenue in two fights, which only lasted one, one hour, two fights, generated a total total uh, revenue of two hundred and fifty million dollars. They're not even on my level.